Sometimes <clears throat> you might be told to draw a tangent to your ellipse. Like drawing a tangent. So what you do is at any of these points here, you know this point is as a result of F1 and F2. So you might take one of these points here or this point here and you draw a straight line that will go to your F1 like this. Can you see that? And you draw a line F2 that would be the same point also. Like this. Right? So these two points, you're going to bisect it that angle. So in bisecting the angle, I will have something like this. This is here also. I'll bisect. This is here also. I'll bisect. So where they meet, we're going to draw a line that will pass through that center to that point. Can you see that? And I'll draw this. So at this point like this, this is my perpendicular line. And if I want to draw my tangent, I'll just place a compass in this direction. This in the direction you can see. I'll ensure it is falling 90 degrees, which is the edge of my set square. I see that? And I'll just draw this. So then I'll just complete it this way. This is my tangent and this is my normal. And so also in this ellipse concentric method, if I want to draw a tangent to this ellipse here, what I will do is the same procedure. I'll place my compass at the center to this point A here, right? Now take it to point C. I at the minor circle. Now I'm going to draw my arc this way. And I'll draw my arc this way. Then I'll place it here where they intersect. You can see that? So they intersect them at this point. F1. Now what? F2. So I'm going to follow the same process. Just at any of these points here where it is on the ellipse, I'm going to draw a straight line meet at that point also from F to 2 I'll draw another straight line that will meet now they are forming this shape so using my compass I'll place it at this point here and I'll draw an arc like this so drawing the arc with the same radius I'm going to draw a bisection line let me bisect the angle so I bisect the angle this is where they meet at the center point there I'll draw a straight line that I'm going to pass through this point here right just like this so from here this is my normal and if I want to draw the tangent I'm going to place it this way. That's how I place it. I will ensure this edge is in line with my C square. And give me space here. Let's draw my line. I see the line I'm drawing. I can now place my rule to be, all, to be in line with this. Can you see that? So I'm going to draw this. So that is my tangent. This is my tangent, right? And this is my normal.
So they are told to draw a tangent, you just draw only this. This one will be faint line. If I say draw a tangent and a normal, both of them will be taken. Thank you very much for watching.